So I want to show you a little trick uh, when you're actually preparing to mark all of your um, interfacing to stick back on the back of your fabrics, you're going to be following the plan um, that is in the pattern from uh, Lise Bélanger Ariel. And so I wanted to show you, this is a good example to show uh, what, what you need to do. So she, every piece is, is actually numbered from one to a hundred. So you know how to follow along in uh, making your piecing and uh, for your applique. And they're also color coded, um, which is really going to help you uh, understand where you're going. When there is, a, for example, for the horse itself, and the background, they're definitely color coded. So A is the background, B, C, and D are actually the three different colors that you'll find on the horse. See here, there are three tones, lighter, medium, and dark. So it is going to help you out in making the pattern. So here I have six B, so you would be tempted to just mark this piece on your interfacing and then move on to seven, and then you'll notice that there's a six B on top. So this is actually um, a guide. Uh, when you're following along here, you have the pattern that shows you where to add a quarter of an inch when you're cutting out your pieces for the overlapping. And so you can clearly see that there's just one, si one number six, and it's actually the complete thing, which means that you're gonna be making one piece and this one will be overlapping over it. Uh, so that's something that you really need to follow along when you're making the pattern. So you'll be placing your interfacing and really going through making just one line and then marking as it's marked here, the overlapping, which means that here you're going to have, once it's set, you're going to cut out the interfacing a quarter of an inch all around all of the marking that you're going to have done. But then when it's going to be time to cut on the fabric, you'll be cutting on this dotted line here, but then you'll be cutting directly on that uh, line here because there's it's going to be the final sh look uh, when you'll be making the pattern 6B is here. So this section will actually be going over this section here. So it's the one here that's going to be overlapping a quarter of an inch underneath that section. So it does get confusing. You really need to be careful uh, when you're following along to make sure that you are making one, one single piece. And same here with the number seven here, um, you see that there's this main that's going over it, but you're still going to be cutting out the whole piece, making, you're gonna be making your own line here when you're making your inter, when you're preparing your interfacing for the, uh, for your fabric. So you see here, it's gonna go one line straight to the top and then overlapping at a quarter of an inch here. And, um, which is exactly uh, what you see here. So that's how you're going to be preparing your interfacing uh, with the help, uh, with the guide of the pattern and the guides here for all your overlapping before you actually put it onto your fabric.